Welcome to Armed in All Hearts. Now, since I've been told encouragement is sort of my thing, the Bible says God blesses us with everything we need to enjoy life. 1 Timothy 6.17 What this Bible verse means to me. I think some people would think that this is materialistic things. And I think, yeah, it can be. You enjoy life, you play your video games, or you, you like getting on Twitter, and, or you like getting on Instagram. But I think it goes beyond that. I look at it as, what are our blessings in life? What are the blessings, the little things, that we often don't think about, that we are blessed with, that gives us a happy and enjoyful life? Like, you got up today. You're watching my show, of all shows. God gave you breath in your lungs. God gave you a couple more heartbeats to live more. So you're living more. You're breathing more. You got to go to the grocery store and get groceries. There's a roof over your head. People might have helped you pay your rent. Your bills are paid. Your stomach's full. You got, might have cars to drive. My neighbor was just blessed. And he's been waiting a while. I gotta share this. My neighbor's been waiting a while to have cars for his wife, for his mother-in-law, and for himself. And they all been sharing one beat up car. And you could hear, hear it coming down the street. And he said everything was, you know, basically falling off. It was like that car that was being held on by duct tape and spit. And he's been waiting. And that guy, I tell you, that guy, he just, I wish I could be more like him. Because in all this trial, it seemed like he never saw it that way. He always seemed like he was always enjoying life. Because he was always thankful for at least he had a car that was still going, even though it sounded like it could break down at any day. But he was patient. And he's a man of faith, and so is his wife, and so is his mother-in-law. And coming home and seeing that God blessed them with the financial stability now to have three used but new cars and fill their needs. Oh, testify! So I think enjoying life is the little things in life that we take for granted each day. So don't take for granted your life. There's a lot of things that we might gripe about, and I do it too. But there's a lot of things that we, lots of days we don't think about that are truly the blessings that keep us living. Now a quote about enjoying life. Slow down and enjoy life. It's not only the scenery you miss by going too fast, you also miss the sense of where you're going and why. Eddie Cantor. Wow. That's kind of like what I just said, right? Like thinking about the little blessings. Trying not to go too fast. But take a moment like my neighbor was just to be thankful in the moment of what you do have. Because one day you know the blessings are coming. Thank you for watching. May God bless you and keep you. And if you don't know Jesus as your Lord and Savior... May he lead you to him in Jesus' name. Now stay tuned for a flashback from a previous season of Armed in All Heart. As though great, you just woke my wife up. <laughs> Remember, even with my wife now up, dream big, keep fighting, and get some! <laughs> exactly. Come on, Brett. Come on, Brett. Come on, Brett. Oh, ooh, ooh. Easy. There you go. Easy. There you go.
Get it! <sighs> All 13 weeks of my hard work leading up to the Mongo Muscle Summer Bash has now come to a close. I want to thank everybody that has supported me this far and even especially the people that came out to my meet yesterday just to see me lift. So, BMG, you actually have people that believe in you that much? Even though you have limited views on YouTube? Even though you are not Instagram famous? Even though you're always screaming and yelling about that Jesus Christ stuff? Oh yes, my friends. And what a blessing it is. Arms and all heart. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Uh, like Mack Truck or something. Once in a while, swinging, see what he's been doing. Cali Muscle. Cali Muscle. I'll check in on him. And of course, um, over there at uh, the BMG himself, over there at uh, Armed and All Heart. He's got a very unique delivery. and I like the guy. I know the guy. I like the guy. He's, you know, that Jesus freak guy. So, you know, he does powerlifting. He competes in powerlifting. He's a strong mother effer. He's all natural. And he's, he's real. He's totally real. He shows. His life is totally real and uh, you know his training all that crap you know and he talks about the Lord his relationship with the Lord and he tries to motivate and he's very motivational extremely motivational that guy don't get you revved up your heart ain't beating you better check your pulse